What's going on there, friends and neighbors? I am Rob Unboxes, and I've got a box from Urban Outfitter. Or is it Urban Outfitters? I don't know. Plural. Anyway, a little bit of a story time as I'm opening this extremely carefully. I originally got on the second printing release of the In Tongues vinyl from Judgy, and uh, inexplicably, my order was canceled for some reason. To this day, I still don't know why. I contacted Urban Outfitters, and uh, apparently there was nothing to be done. They never got back to me, so I had lost all fucking hope of ever owning this physically. But thank the gods, well, thank Joji actually, there was a second printing that came out near instantaneously after, well, a third printing after the second printing had sold out so quick. As soon as I saw that tweet, I did not wait, I did not anything, I just went straight to the link, I pre-ordered another copy, and all was well. Well, technically all wasn't well because I had been suffering from uh, a severe state of worry simply due to the fact of not knowing whether I would actually get this. So sometime after that, another pre-order was put up for a clear vinyl version of the In Tongues EP and I got that one too. <laughs> so I will actually have two copies of this wondrous, wondrous piece of music on vinyl at some point whenever that uh, gets released. Uh, apparently it had been delayed yet again, which seems to be happening with this vinyl release uh, rather, uh, rather frequently. So uh, I'm sorry, I thought I would be done by now unboxing this, but this is uh, very well boxed. Oh, here we go. And uh, another side to the story is, hold on, let's check. Okay, we got, we got stuff, we got an order sheet. Okay, no little extras are included. So to add to this story just a little bit more. Oh fuck, there it goes, my train of thought. I completely forgot what I was going to say. Uh, I don't know if I'm actually going to be using this on my record player because apparently my brand of record player is notoriously known for uh, ruining vinyl and uh, I think I'm either going to frame this one or the clear vinyl version. I'm not sure, but one of them's getting framed. Framed. One of them is getting framed and another one, I guess, I will be playing with and listening to. Or I'm just going to frame the both of them. Who knows? Time will tell. And oh my God, my heart has jumped into my throat. Oh my God, I can't believe I'm actually holding this right now. And here it is. The In Tongues EP by Joji with the blue cover. I prefer this cover over the deluxe edition cover. Oh, what I was going to say earlier, I was so worried about possibly not getting this. Oh yeah, here's the back, 88 Rising, Empire Records. I was so worried about not getting this. I actually went to Urban Outfitters with my friend Jay while he was uh, clothes shopping just to see if my local Urban Outfitters actually had this in stock not to my surprise they did not have this in stock oh jesus i hate shrink wrap on fucking vinyls like this get off of my shirt here it is yet again lovely 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 here's the back yet again i can't believe i'm actually holding this <laughs> so um very carefully and there is the vinyl. On side B, we have Windows, Bitterfuck, and World Star Money. While on side A, we have Will He, Pills, and Demons. I'm going to put this back in that thing. So I know this is a bit of a short video and such, but this has uh, definitely been something that I've been looking forward to for quite some time, ever since those links went up. And uh, to finally have this in my collection, uh, let me tell you, I, I feel really, really fucking good about finally having it. Not sure again which, which version of this I'm going to be framing or not, but I have it. The In Tongues EP on vinyl from Joji. I'm really hoping for a CD release. I'm really hoping for a cassette release. They'll though I doubt it because the album's coming out in September now. But yes, this is it. That was the vinyl. You've seen the unboxing. This is the whole thing. Hope you enjoyed this. I, I, I would like to do more unboxings like this aside from the loot anime and loot crate videos, but you know, unboxing videos are either left or right. You're never really going to uh, get too much out of it, but I felt like this release definitely deserved it, especially with my history and being fucked over by Urban Outfitters once. Let's hope that doesn't happen a second time. But anyway, I have been Rob Unboxes of 
Crazy Calyx. Hope you enjoyed this short little unboxing video. I will see you all tomorrow with the uh, Metroid Fusion stream that I'll be doing probably around 10 o'clock, but I'll update you then and there. The clear vinyl version of this release is still up for pre-order. I do not think it has been sold out yet. I'll include a link in the description below if it is still on order. If not, I'll just show some text on the screen and tell you it's sold out. But until next time, everybody, which will be tomorrow, I have been Robin Boxes. Hope you enjoyed, and I will see you all tomorrow. Game stream. I'm repeating myself. Bye. Thank you.